guys what's up today we're gonna start up with the caddy reverse proxy and last video we have gone through the caddy basic setup now we we'll let's get started with the reverse proxy before going through reverse proxy let's know what is a reverse proxy so there's a website and which says a definition like the reverse proxy serves as a gateway between users and your application origin sub server and here's your users and users make a request and in turn this reverse proxy acts as a gateway and this is your origin server rather than directly making request to your origin server we're gonna use a reverse proxy over here it acts as an intermediate Moreover, it gives us a good security and reliability. And here's some other information. And forwarding the original request. You can go to this website if you want more information. Okay, let's get started. Okay, there are two ways of using this reverse proxy. One is through command line. You can just type your caddy reverse proxy and your port number. Here's a from do stuff and here's a carry file. We're gonna go through with the carry file stuff. That makes more easier. So here's a local host reverse proxy and here's a port number. We're gonna copy this. Let's go back to our folder. This is a carry application. This is a carry file. Let's open it with your notepad now i'm gonna paste this local host it doesn't take much time to type so it's fine copy pasting okay before this uh i don't have anything running on my port 9000 so let me check if i have running on one two three four Let's go back to the website and check our localhost port if it is okay. Uh, my localhost port 1234 is hosting some files, that is some documentation or SQL. And let me check with the localhost. Probably it must be empty. Okay, it's empty, it's not running any stuff. Let's go back over here. Now I'm gonna I want the 1234 port to be run on localhost default port. Okay, so I'll tell it again. I want this 1234 port to be running on my localhost default port. Okay, I'm gonna save this. I'm gonna go back to my command prompt uh, carry file run iPhone iPhone watch. Okay, it's running. Let's go back to our browser and do a refresh. Yay, it's working. So probably this is the main port and this is a intermediate port which is running my actual port that is one, two, three, four. So this is the reverse proxy guys. That's it, nothing else. Hope you get it. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more videos. Have a great day. Bye.